Welcome back on the program this morning. We kick start with um, Saturday Telegraph as the big story here says insecurity government kidnapped 20 medical dental students in Beno State. Uh, very pathetic uh, there as a police confirmed incident launch investigation and also a number of commissioner wife kidnapped eight killed. All right, sir. Uh, all of these stories there on the front page of uh, Saturday Telegraph. More stories here. 27 High Court judges to face NJC Pro panel over alleged judicial misconduct. And FG State local government share 1.3 trillion naira revenue in July. And on the blueprint uh, weekend, the big story here says a state-owned airport on viable, wasteful. That's according to expert and stakeholders. Uh, the writer there says uh, most of them only serve governor's interest. Leaders need to prioritize nation's development, citizens' welfare. You are an embodiment of honor, selfless service to the nation. That's uh, according to uh, Governor Bagotu, uh, IBB at 83. Back to Lagos, where several shops are affected as fire guards seven-story building. Another story here says uh, court sentences, uh, three drug kimpings, uh, 16 others to 302 years in prison. Relief as government stakeholders work to make food available. APC will win rivers convincingly with or without a major's group. That's according to Okocha. Some stories on the front page of uh, the Blueprint. Saturday Independent, now financial autonomy. Why Supreme Court must enforce compliance on functions of local government. Uh, very interesting there. We'll be having one of the chairmen there to talk about uh, the financial autonomy on the program this morning. All right, state governments must comply with judgment. Ahamba Ozakome Dangba, they're talking. Uh, power must return to the grassroots. Udose Njoku. Lock jam now in constitutional joint accounts in Meka Kalu there. ADC kicks as uh, kicks against Saludo's September 28 council polls. And reasons why Nigeria's tax policy must continue to be in doldrum. And Captain Carl Crick there talking. And Chinese film releases Nigeria's seized presidential jets. Page 30 there of. Um, Saturday Independent newspaper. This morning, open defecation or going to commence prosecution of offenders. And to the leadership weekend, uh, the story here says bandits, leaders, and force peace in Zamfara villages allow villagers access to firms, stop levies, defend affected areas against the rival attacks. Uh, Residents recount experiences on uh, coexistence. Police admits uh, decrease in attacks. Another story here says federal government to stop allocations of local government without elected chairman in October. Interesting. That's on page seven of the leadership weekend. Uh, not East region needs legacy roads uh, projects. Governor Mohammed says and JC to probe 27 judges over misconduct. Some I stories on uh, the front page of the leadership. And platform times, FG estate, local government here, one point. Three five eight trillion era for July. All right. Um, we hope more uh, developments will get to the grassroots and to die by hanging for mother armed robbery in Delta. Twenty seven High Court judges to face NJC pro panel for alleged misconduct. Wage award difference from seventy thousand era minimum wage. NLC they're talking. On the masthead we have police arrest suspected cult leader in Ogun. That's Ogun State. All right, uh, Anambra LB Guba aspirants who want to reject Saludo's proposed local government polls and police identify BRT boss attackers. And trade leaders council appoint Kyle D, Honorable Kyle Diamuso, as a patron. All of the stories there on the front page of the Platform Times. And to uh, the first news, the big story here is on Nigeria's escalating insecurity. Anambra rules from kidnappings, killings. Commissioner wife abducted, eight killed in a Boja highway attack. Another eight abducted, 12 injured at traditional ceremony in Orumba. President Tunubu most demonized the Nigerian, but has a good soul. That's according to 
the vice president, Kashim Shatima. And a picture story here shows uh, the governor of Lagos State, Babajide Sonwolu, during the commissioning of a twin housing project in the Aboyi K2 uh, Lake Council Development Area of the state. On the bottom strip, Nigeria's future stolen, over 20 medical students abducted in Bainway. Nara Plummet's father hit 1590 Nara per dollar in the parallel market. Uh, Afeba Balola says uh, Tenebu's government channing Nigerians to beggars. With raw soldiers from southeast region, they're making things worse. Igbo women beg the federal government. Some stories on the front page of the First News. Leadership weekend, bandit leaders enforce peace in Zamfara villages. Allow villagers access to farms, stop levies. More riders there defend affected areas against rival attacks. Resident recount experiences on coexistence and also police admit a decrease in attacks. All of the stories there on the front page of Leadership Weekend this morning. And uh, finally, on uh, the sporting life, Mareska Mom on Simen says it is not correct to talk about an Apollis player. Nottingham uh, versus Bournemouth. Awoni eyes their first EPL goal since February. On the Eagles uh, coaching job, NFF to unveil surprise coach Renard Charles. Some flats lose out. Some stories on the front page of the sporting life. All right, uh, get a copy of the delays there and keep yourself abreast with events and happenings